What's up, everybody? Provis here with another episode of Magic Duel's Origins, and we got it. We got. I think. I think we got it. I mean, I feel confident. I added another evolving wilds uh, at the expense of a single mountain uh, in terms of the lands. Uh, still not sure about Rogue's Passage. I might actually. Actually, should I just dump it? Eh, I kind of want two in there, just just in case. All right, we got the. Uh, we got an extra. All right, so um, we we. Last episode, uh, I, I don't know if you guys are actually like watching this in order or whatever, but last episode we had a super cool subscriber, Patrick McFarland, uh, gave us a a deck list that I copied, and I tried it, and I liked it. I liked the direction it went in. It definitely focused more on uh, the first strike, which is something I think my deck lacked, but I had to change it up because there were no bombs in it at all, and I, I, I feel like that... The deck genuinely needs bombs. So anyway, that's the mana curve now. Uh, it was a little, little too heavy, um, relying on on small things. So several things me uh, didn't make the cut. Let's see if we can find them. Uh, we got uh, hello, 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 hello. We got rid of. Well, I mean, I guess you could just look at it yourself. I mean, it's not like it's not like it's not like it's a it's not on record anyway. But we did get rid of Titan Strength here. Uh, didn't didn't like it. Oh, well, that's not true, actually. I do like it. I, I love it, you know, in conjunction with uh, Double Strike, but it, it just never ends up going that way. There's just too few... There's only two Double Striking creatures in the entire deck. It, the uh, the Flyer, who starts out as 1-1, one, one, and the Rose Champion, who just is a 2-2. Two, two. And yes, Titan Strength adds 6 damage, but it never goes on these guys. I always stick it on something else. Uh, Glory Chaser got, all, got out of here. I kept the removal. Removal's damn helpful. I'm going to stick with Knight of the White Orchid. Um, Patrick convinced me of it. Uh, I, I don't want to admit that too much, but uh, the first strike is, is still useful. Uh, I, I mean, I'm only having two of them, so hopefully he doesn't... I, I, I don't know. I, I hate this card, but I'm going to hang on to him. Pretty much all the creatures um, have first strike uh, in some form. I mean, double strike is essentially first strike, too. Except for the bombs. Uh, we got the Archangel of Tithes, who can definitely get cut. I'm not sure if I want to keep her. Definitely keeping this guy. Uh, I threw in Avaricious Dragon, just because uh, it's pretty decent in late game. Like, if I don't have a lot of cards in my hand, which, by the way, I tend to not have a lot of cards in my hand, this is a great way to get uh, more plays. Hixus is actually a board wipe of sorts with sort of haste, so I am going to hang on to him. And Tragic Arrogance, I think, is also... Uh, actually, I think it could be cut. Possibly. I'm not sure how I feel about this, honestly. Uh, Tragic Arrogance, it might hit me worse than, than my opponent, but... I'm going to hang on to it just... I mean, it is enchantment removal, sort of, as long as they have multiple enchantments and shit, but... Uh, actually, actually I'm, now that I'm like saying it out loud, I feel like I should actually dump Tragic Arrogance. But, because I mean, in terms of getting rid of creatures, I have Hixus now. One of these made the cut for some fucking reason. Don't ask me why. I have no idea. Um, yeah, so this is the deck list. So we're going to we're gonna go. We're, we're going to get in there. And we're going to do it. So, Pat, God damn it. Patrick, thank you. Thank you, man. Seriously. Good, good job. <laughs> nice. We can do this. We can do this. Just slight changes. Why did I cancel? Slight changes to the deck. Um, added more bombs. The mana curve got a little bit heavier. But then again, we're running 24 lands, so it's not that bad to to run run you know fatter spells. So hopefully this can push us a little over the edge. I think I'm gonna do. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. If it needs any changes, I think I'm gonna. I think I'll do another episode if it doesn't really need I mean of course it's gonna need some changes but uh, I think this might be the last um, episode of this deck I don't know you know what I'll I'll let you know after this episode <laughs> I shouldn't make predictions because they are always wrong by default uh, oh, my god. oh my god oh my god okay okay it's like, it's just a land problem, right? Like, it's not me. It, it's just the lands. Is it me? Is, is this... Should I have kept the first one? I don't know, man. I, I don't know. It hurts, man. It hurts my, my body. But you know what? Actually, maybe this isn't so bad. I, everything in my hand is playable. That's good. That's good to see. 
That's good to see. Is he playing on a second main? Or is he just passing turn? No, he's passing turn. Alright, fine. That means he's got like a twin twin bolt or some kind of removal or some shit. Great. Well, guess what, asshole? I have some too. So, eat it. I don't know if I like exquisite firecraft in here. Double red, when I'm already drowning in double white, makes me feel dirty. I don't, I don't know if I like it. I, I put, a, put it in here because, you know, Chandra. Alright, we're definitely doing Rakdo, so, um... But they have no plays on turn 3, which is really weird. They do have plays. Who am I kidding? They actually do have plays. They have plays, but they didn't play anything. They have plays, but they didn't play anything. That means they have... That means they have... Twin Bolt, right? So what do I play? What do I play? All right, that's what I'm gonna play. I'm I'm convinced that they have a twin bolt in hand, but they didn't use it then, so maybe they don't. I don't know, man. I, I'm I'm all I'm all messed up now. He's doing racked He's gonna steal it. Like he has plays. See, it's pausing on his second and main and first main phase. He's just not doing anything. Uh, I'm just gonna swing the hell in. What you got for me, son? Twin bolt? I'm assuming it's a twin bolt. There it is. Yeah, all right. It was a twin bolt. Fucking knew that shit was coming. I guess he was waiting for me to misplay and play something on my first main. I'm not gonna do that, dude. That's dumb. One more land, and I actually got a Hixus on the field, which is kind of nice. Uh, but he's probably running... Yeah, see, it's paused on his first main, so he does have plays. Well, maybe that was his play. Nope, it's still paused, so he has another play. Don't know what it is this time. So he's obviously running some kind of control build. Tragic Arrogance will help later. Not now. No, no, no stopping this now. Maybe he's got a, a creature steal of some kind, and he's waiting to, uh, well, that, that's, I don't know, man, he's, he's throwing me off here, I don't know what the hell's going on. I have quite a bit of removal in hand, I almost want to get rid of Exquisite Firecraft, actually. It was just filling up a single, a single open slot. I was at, like, 59 cards, not sure, ah, oh, that's what he got, that's what he's got for me. Alright, now, now he's gonna steal it with the, uh, Act of Treason. Is that what you're gonna do? You're not gonna do that. Oh, you don't have active treason. Oh, sorry, dude. That's gotta go. I know what your deal is. I know exactly what you have in mind. I will not allow you to do that. <laughs> He's got the other one. The, uh, the four cost one, right? Okay, the one that gives, like, plus two plus O, oh, or is it plus two plus two? I don't remember. Uh, this is great, actually. I'm, I'm actually in a very good position right now. Surprisingly, I don't know what I want to get. Uh, probably a white, I guess, maybe? I don't know. I'm probably gonna get- yeah, I'll get a planes. I'll get a planes. I still have plays. I have a lot of plays. All my plays, actually. There's a couple of creatures that I don't give a shit about. Why do you have that? Why do you need that? Oh, to sacrifice to Nantuko Husk, I guess? Maybe? I guess. I don't know. Oh, alright, for Bone Splinters. Yeah, okay, that makes sense then. I hear you, bro. I hear you now. But now you're down to one card. <laughs> I'll get a planes. He's down to one card now. So he's full of poop. You're in trouble, bro. What are you gonna do? I guess I could just drop Hixus next turn if I don't have anything that I want to play now. Um... I will. No, oh, you know what? Mm, boy, I won't actually. No, I'll I'll wait till he has more shit on the on the field. I, I want to see how he deals with this creature first, because I'm I'm pretty convinced that one of his cards is the um, oh, what the hell is it called? Not not the Act of Trees and the four drop of the Act of Trees in effect. I, I don't remember what it is. Contagious blood blood or something? No, no, that's the aura. Whatever. You know what I'm you know what I'm talking about. Um. 
Alright, so nothing's really happening right now. Though that's a waste of a car. <laughs> Alright, there, there's a there's a reason not to run Nimbus Wings. By the way, Patrick, I did I did switch out the uh, Grasp of the Hyromancer for Nimbus Wings, in case you didn't notice. Uh, and I did find myself in an exact situation where it is the least useful. <laughs> so, <laughs> GG for me. Alright, he's only got two black sources. I mean, that's enough. Well, that's not true. That's enough to do quite a bit. But I don't see him doing a whole lot. Uh, do I want to drop a Hyksis now? Not really. The good thing is... Oh, 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 oh my. Uh, I might have to Exquisite Fire... Ooh, shit, and he can do it now. Fuck. He can do it right now. Yep, Act of Treason. Oh, Act of Treason. Alright. Okay, that's fine. And now he wants to eat it up. Now, I can't actually block the Nantuko Husk, because he'll just eat his other two creatures. Oh wait, no, it's not it's not getting blocked anyway. <laughs> Alright. Uh right there. The only one I can. Uh guess what, dude? My thing resolves first, so now you can no longer Yeah, you, well actually he should have done it then, but he fucked up. You fucked up, son. I not that it mattered, honestly. It would have just gone to my graveyard, now it's just exiled. So, whatever. I don't know. It's up to this dude. Hmm. I can play them both. I can do them both, baby. I can do both. You're in trouble, man. You gonna do something about this? You gonna do something about this? What are you gonna do? I would like to exquisite Firecraft his face. But I feel... I mean, if... I know what he does. He's Rakdos. So this is actually way more important for me. Because, uh... That's essentially removal for my creature. So, I would like to put him to four, but he's got, like, an, if he has another act of treason or something, which I, I really feel like he has. Yup, there it is. <laughs> there it is. And then an extra five damage to me. And, uh, and then he's fucked. He'll hit me for five. I'm going to 13. And then uh, I still have a tragic arrogance in hand. He's completely top decking. I got him dead in two turns, unless I get something nicer. I will not get another Exquisite Firecraft. I'm only running a one-up of those. Uh, and that does not go to the face, unfortunately. So it will be another turn for him. Which is fine by me. Alrighty. Awesome. Super happy. That That is a win. <laughs> Hicks is fucking winning the day somehow. Don't know how to do it. Oh, he, he shows me he's done. Alright, man. Good, good game. Good try. Unfortunately, I knew exactly what was in your hand, so it wasn't really... Yeah. I, good game, man. Yeah, when when, when he did... I, I knew exactly what was going on as soon as uh, turn 3 happened, and he had no plays. That At that point, it was pretty obvious he had uh, he was doing that Act of Treason deck. Uh, I did think he, he missed a, a point. He could have... Um, he had the mana to steal and kill one of my creatures at one point. And he chose not to for some reason. I guess he was getting greedy. Uh, I don't think that would have changed the outcome of the game, but it could have prolonged it. Because uh, I still had Tragic Arrogance. I still had a lot of ways to deal with uh, anything that he could drop. So I'm not too worried about it. And if you're going to be running Nantuko Husk over Bloodflow Connoisseur, you need to be a little more aggressive. Maybe he just didn't get his aggressive cards, but... Uh, you, you, you don't want to be passing turn too much. Wow, what a... Yeah, Alright, we're both we're both doing it, man. Oh, God. I have no plays. No, I have one play. Twin Bolt. You know what? He went down to six. I'll go down to six, too. Holy shit, this is awful. Okay. God damn, man. Do I need more lands? Do I need less? I don't know what's happening. I'll tell you one thing, I'm probably getting rid of that Rogue's Passage. I'm, I'm sick of it. It's not doing me any goddamn favors. That thing's out of here. Out of here. Alright, so Azorius Flyers, maybe? No, because he would have put down a Flyer by now. That's weird. Uh, a Crow and Sergeant over a Rose Champion. Over Skyhunter's... Uh, Skyhunter Skimmer. Oh, no, actually, wait, 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 wait. A crow first, then Sky Hunter, then a rose. Save the best one for last. 
Alright, he has no plays. It skipped his, his second main entirely. Uh, that's actually pretty good, too. For later, not now. I still want that sergeant out there. Patrick's idea to, to include the uh, sergeant, by the way. Patrick, thank you. That was a good idea. I think he is a, a good enough creature. He's a good, uh, a good filler creature. Not not great on his own, but he's he's still filler enough to uh to get us to curve out a little nicer, more nicely. I guess I could also Nimbus Wings here if he has a creature. I don't know. He he's got to play. He played his land and it's still stuck on his first main, so he's got something to put down. Uh, that is something I just don't really give a shit about. I mean, I really don't care about that card. Why didn't I put down the planes? That's so dumb. Then I could have, uh... I could have done more things. Could have done more things, and now I can't. Now I have to wait for him to get another thing. Uh, I will Sky Hunter and leave my Fiery Impulse open. I don't think I'm going to be hitting that, that cat with a Fiery Impulse. I think I'm just going to pass turn. Whoop! Don't know why I did it with a mouse that time. And yeah, nice and fast. Frost Link. Yeah, it is a cat. <laughs> it's a fucking Cheshire-looking cat right there. I would not want to pet that cat. It looks scaly. It's gross. There's, like, arms coming out of the ground here for no reason. Why? Hey, you did your land. All right, cool. Uh, Knight of the White Orchid is actually relevant now. Yeah, I'm not doing that trade. That's ridiculous. So the, you're you're getting in there. No idea what this guy's playing. Uh, I thought it was his Aureus Flyers, but he didn't have any Flyers yet. Oh, he's just doing that weird control deck thing. Okay. Um, you know what? I don't ever see this guy played, so I'm going to take a look at this guy. Uh, whenever a creature becomes a target of a spell, you gain control of it. Right, 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 right. Does it come into play tapped? No. Okay, so I can play Nimbus Wings after that, uh, which is what I'm going to do. <laughs> Nimbus Wings on my 2-2. Two -two. Oh, wait. No, I can't do that. Wait, is it a spell that you control or any fucking spell? A spell or ability you control. Okay, good. That that makes me feel better. Uh, yeah, that's where it's going. A spell or ability that that any any time it's it's like <laughs> it's like flag bearer for bosses, right? Here I am thinking that this guy's the flyer deck, and I'm out flying him way more. Silly me. All right. Getting some damage going on there. Got six damage on the field, as far as he knows. Uh, probably I roll as champion. Kithian's irregulars is also a good a good possibility. Um, I actually need more sorceries to put this on spell mastery, so I can get rid of that fucking two three of his, because that two three is making me upset. <laughs> uh, I will be swinging in with a white of the night orchid actually, and then he'll probably block with his two two cat. And then he'll eventually have to block with his 2-3 guy. Oh, shit, dude. No, man, you just you did me a fucking favor here. Holy crap. Yeah, I don't want that on the field at all. Even if... No, man, you, uh, can you do it instant speed? Can you do something? I have no idea what he can do. He has to target this creature now. He's got the mana for something. Disperse. Bounce it back to his hand. Oh, bounce my guy back to his hand. Okay. Alright. Uh, but it still goes to my hand, right? I mean, I know you targeted it, but it still goes to my hand. Alright. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, man. That sucks, dude. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, I'm still swinging in. <laughs> if you want to do that again, I'm, I'm pretty happy. <laughs> Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I, I didn't think he would swing in like that. That's a really delicate creature. Like, I, I wouldn't waste it like that. But uh, he, he obviously thought differently. Actually, in this... No, 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 no. no. I, want, I want the lands. I'll get the lands out. Because now I can... I, I was thinking of putting down Aroa's Champion first. But now I can actually put down Kithian's Irregulars next turn and tap a creature at the same time. So I think that's a better better play. Let's see if he does it again. <laughs> now that he knows I'm running this shit. Uh, he's in a lot of trouble. He has not done a whole lot, honestly. Uh, not doing the best. Displacement wave. Kind of sucks for three. 
Hang on, for three? So what are we getting here? That's staying, that's going. Going, going, going. So all this shit is going to my hand. Actually, even Nimbus Wings is going to my hand. Do I want to do anything about it? No, I can't do anything about it anyway. Uh, but now I have enough lands to drop Kithian's Irregulars and tap him instantaneously, which is kind of nice to have. And I didn't actually lose anything. It's all still in my hand. Hmm. Unless I don't want to drop Kithian's Irregulars. What else What else can I do? I could do a Crohn's... Let's see, I have, what, six? I could just drop both of these guys. That'd be interesting. Both of them? Both? Tap target creature. Because I could make him tap himself if he can't actually gain control of it. Hmm. No, actually, I'm going to drop the sergeant. I'm, I'm, all right, my, my, point, my thinking is to leave the fiery impulse open to pop something that needs to get popped. So that's what I'm going to do. I want to put down more creatures. So I'm not going to just drop one Kithian's Irregulars. I mean, he's at nine. I can take a few hits here. Not the worst deal in the world. He's definitely not swinging in. I can kill him first strike. First strike. Jesus, that's hard to pronounce, isn't it? Good game so far for my opponent. I'm, I'm actually having a good time. I'm having a great time. That's a weird card to have. I mean, it's a good general card, but I don't think... I mean, I don't know what his deck does. So far, it just stalls me. So he must have some kind of a massive bomb of some sort. Oh, hey, check it out. You gain control of it. Congratulations. Don't swing. <laughs> Don't fucking swing. I wonder if he remembers what happened last time. Uh, looks like he doesn't. Okay. Well, we'll do it again, then. Do you have a trick? Another Disperse? You're down to two cards now. And I still got a bunch of plays. You're not looking too good, man. What the fuck does that do? Honestly, what the fuck does that do? Return target tap. N no creatures were tapped. You just brought this guy back to my hand? What did you do? Oh, he saved his creature? No, he didn't. He didn't. It wasn't... How did he fuck that up? As he enters the battlefield, you may return target tap creature and opponent controls. Oh, I didn't have any tap creatures. So, you fucked up. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. What do I want to do now? I would like... Actually, I'm going to swing in first. Uh, he's all tapped out. I don't think he's got anything to do. He's only got one card left. He's dead. So this game is over, actually, now that I'm looking at it. Uh, fine, dude. No problem at all. I got way more creatures coming. Coming to ruin your day! I don't think he can do anything. One card left. He can crack that, uh... He can crack the artifacts, but they're not gonna do damn things. He can chump me a little. Make the Nimbus Wings a little harder. Nimbus Wings is going on the Knight of the White Orchid. Yeah, this guy's not doing anything. He's, he's dead. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, man. Don't know what he... Don't know what his deck does. It's weird. Um, a bunch of control -y fun things, which I really like. Maybe I want to make a deck out of that, because that's definitely not in the meta right now. I feel like that's uh, way more fun. He's definitely going to try to trick me with the uh, with the foundry of the consoles or whatever. I'm going to swing in. He's going to pause. He's going to crack it open. He's going to get a couple of blockers. Yeah, I know what you're doing, man. Old news. But uh, he has to chump, because there's nothing else they can do. He's still getting hit for three. He's going to four. And then he's probably dead next turn. Because I'm going to drop a Kithian's Irregulars, and it's going to tap somebody down. Yeah, unfortunately, this guy didn't really do a lot. I do like his deck. its I mean, he's playing cards that people don't often play. Mostly Willbreaker. Willbreaker is a hard card to play. Uh, you get two of them, right? Yeah, you do. And he doesn't actually have any creatures. He doesn't have any cre- Yeah, you're still dead. I mean, he's just bouncing my shit back. That's all he's doing. 
I, I'm going to do this a little more elegantly. I'm going to do it with the Kithians. I could just fiery impulse one of them, but I want to. I want to. I want to justify. Uh, he's gone. <laughs> I want to justify having Kithians irregulars in here because it is a decent card. I mean, it didn't really play to its potential today, but it can definitely do it. All right, I'll get. I'll get in uh, one more game, right? I think one more game. Or am I already at 30 minutes? Let me just double check. I really should put a counter or timer of some kind. Uh, yeah, I, I can afford one more game. I can afford one more game. That'll, that'll happen. That'll happen. Let's do it. Let's do it. That calls a win. Alright, um, versus. I'm liking how the deck has shaped up a little. I think it's uh, doing a little better. I, I have played a couple of opponents that, mm, let, let, let's say, didn't didn't do their best. Didn't, didn't do 100%, maybe? Hmm? But I like that guy's deck. Um, I would like to make a Willbreaker deck. Ah, oh, God. I, I gotta put that on the agenda, don't I? Just a deck built around, like, blue. I don't know if I would add white, though. White is... that That's a tough color to play with, man, in this format. Battle for Zendikar, white is probably the strongest color. I'm not sure how it's gonna be uh, in duels battles for Zendikar. Or battle for Zendikar. Tokyo! Oh, wow. Naming yourself after the greatest city on Earth. Okay, man. That's that's how you want to run it. Uh, I can keep this. I'm I'm okay with this. Got a couple of slow lands, but they're gonna be getting me two whites or two planes. I don't know. Why I call them white. It's the planes produce white mana, so I call them white, even though they're not white. They're actually colorless cards, and they're not white anyway. They're oh god. I don't know. I'm I'm, I'm rambling right now. Uh, hey hey, I have an idea. Let's play Evolving Wilds and then pass turn. Aw. Evolving Wilds. Save my ass. Thanks, man. Ah, am I playing all four of you guys? I don't think so. I don't think I am. Maybe I should be. Maybe I should get rid of Rogue's Passage and just put in three Evolving Wilds. Or four Evolving Wilds, excuse me. Uh, I got my Avaricious Dragon and a bunch of cards that only cost three or less, so it looks like I'm actually going to be playing Avaricious Dragon. Um, I am actually going to get a planes with the... Oh, we're playing a... Uh, um, what, what, what are we playing? Elves. Elves, right. Elves. Do I just pop that now? Let's see. Can he actually do a lot of damage to me? I don't control any elves. I have three fucking twin bolts. I have no other real play. Fuck it, I'll do it now. Just do it. Just do it. Get it over with. I got three twin bolts. Who cares? Go ahead, bro. Your turn. I could have done it on his turn, but I didn't want to. <laughs> oh, Rakdos elves. That's weird. Okay. Hmm. Rakdos Elves. Rakdos Elves. Okay, so I could put an Eroa's Champion down. I don't want to. I, I want to actually... Actually, that's not true. I will do it. I will do it. I'm going to miss out on the Avaricious Dragon, unfortunately. He's not going to be on time. But... He has to deal with this uh, Double Striker immediately. So... I don't know. Is this better? That's not going to deal with it. That's not dealing with it. Although that's probably gonna flip. Yeah, he's now he's attack. Why didn't you attack, dude? You could have attacked, and then you would have flipped Liliana. Not not the right play. Oh, you want to do it now? I could just kill the Liliana right now, actually. If I'm if I'm really hardcore about it. Um, I will. I will. Because she's a pretty legit card, man. I can't have that playing around. Did I put it all on her? God damn it. I could have fucking swung at his face with that. That's silly. Sorry, I'm getting texted by my... By my fiancé. We're talking about important things. If you didn't know, I am getting married on Friday. 
Friday, Saturday, I don't know. One of, one of those days, it's not a big deal, right? <laughs> Who needs to know that? That's not important. Avaricious Dragon looks like it's coming down. Yeah, okay, you do that. Got rid of your damn Planeswalker, so I'm not too worried about her. Um... Yeah, so sorry, my, my, what I'm saying is my, my attention is slightly distracted while I'm being texted with uh, deets. Ooh, Clifftop is way better than uh, Evolving Wilds. So I will... I will swing first. I think that's obvious. Uh, he is doing the Rakdos, so I'm assuming that he's going to have some kind of... Oh, God. This this makes me feel like I wish I kept uh, a Twin Bolt, but I really wanted that, that Liliana out of here. Because you know he's got... Actually, the Evolving Wilds is better in this case. Because it'll thin out my deck. One less land in it. Because you know he's got the... Uh, the Act of Treason in hand. And he's just going to go, go and try to grab... He's going to grab it. He's going to grab my Avaricious Dragon. And then he's going to eat it. Yep, Traitor's Instinct. That's the card I was thinking about. That's the one. I knew he had it. And I'm going to get smacked for a ton here. Six, seven, eight, nine. So I'm going down to nine. And I'm not getting it back. That sucks, dude. Super sucks. I, I, there's no, yeah. I don't know. I guess I could have not played the Avaricious Dragon. But then he would have, ugh, oh, was that the right play? I don't know. I don't know. Getting the planes here. I knew he had it. And I played right into it anyway. Hmm. Maybe that was the wrong fucking play. Now I'm going to be beating myself up about that for a while. Oh, great! That's exactly... Alright, so what can he hit me for? He's hit me for four. I'm hitting him for four. Shit, unless he's got another one of those traitor's instincts. If he does, he wins. There's no way I'm out of it. I'm getting out of this. By the way, I'm just going to do this right now because I don't want to fucking keep... Drawing lands, because lands suck right now. I got all the lands I need. I need, like, good cards. Things to do. Things to be. Come on. Come on, do it. He's got me beat so far. Like, as as the board state is, he, he will win. And I will lose. Because he's hitting me for four, and I'm only hitting him for four, and I'm at a lower life total, so that's, that, that's game. So any one of my bombs actually will help me out a lot. Uh, Hixis... Um, the Tragic Arrogance. Like, there's a lot out there that could really help me. And I would love to see. That is not a bomb. And now I can no longer swing. So he's obviously just the Rakdos deck. But I thought he was... I thought I saw him play something that didn't really belong. Yeah! The Thornbow Archer. What the fuck are you playing that in the Rakdos um, creature stealing deck? That's such a terrible card to play. Like, it doesn't sink at all. This one does. This is a bomb. This is great. Because you can actually sack out the uh, the priest, and you don't take two damage. So that... Alright. And now we're just staring... Oh, great. Great. That's game, you guys. That is actually game. Like, literally game. Unless this says another... Another creature. Okay, so I'm down to... No, I actually did lose. Nope, I did actually lose. All right, GG, you guys. Good game from my opponent. Um, excellent play. I will see you guys next time. I think I'm going to just do the recording, like, right now. And, yeah, I'm going to do it now. So, hey, love you later.